Sam Noakes and the new WBC International Silver Lightweight Champion. How does that sound? Oh, I'll tell you what, mate. I'm absolutely speechless. It's just can't describe it. And you're in there, and when you come in, you're like you, because. I was keep forgetting, like, where the mate made the championship weight so easy? I, couldn't, I kept forgetting it was for a fucking, sorry, <laughs> for, a, uh, for a title, mate. It's just, just like a dream come true. It's the start of a, a good career ahead. The streak continues. And what's that, 8 and 0 now with 8, eight straight and knockouts? Yeah. Did you think you were going to get it? To be fair, yeah, I thought I had the potential to do it, but I'll give him his credit. He's one tough cookie, but we cracked him in the end. And yeah, I got the last the streak continues. I am happy with that. When he raked his hands off, I thought, could <laughs> Steve? Do you think it was a good stoppage? Uh, yeah, I think it, the combination I got down, I was a little bit one-sided, to be honest. I don't know, like, I thought as the fight got, went on, I got a bit better, but I kept just staying to that right side. I don't know, it just felt like the left hand weren't quite there. But then I think the one that started it was I threw a left hook and then it come through with a right hand. But I just knew I had ten rounds, yeah, and I just thought if I try hell for leather for the first six, like, he's experienced. Like, he's done them 10 rounds for. I thought, if I go hell for leather and I'll get in the back end and I've got nothing in the tank, I'm going to look a little bit silly. So I thought, just winning with my jab. I was jabbing. You see how many jabs I was throwing? And I just thought, all I remember thinking in there, yeah, I just kept going, boom, and he kept going like that. And I thought, cool, all these boxing stuff, I ain't got to get stuck in. I thought, this is nice, mate. But yeah, no, it went really well. I loved it. I, I think I needed the rounds. I can't keep. It's good. It's like, what was it, ninth, ninth round, was ninth it? That's what I'm saying. It's a long old time in there, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, it's better yeah. than them night at six minutes like normal, <laughs> but. Well, you look, you got, you got some rounds and you still got the knockout. And also, you know, this guy went the distance with Mark Chamberlain, don't you? Yeah, I, I, well, that's what I wanted. I wanted to show that I've got a bit of power, but I need to work on the old shot selection. I mean, like, Mark give you a bully him as well, so. But it just shows that as a physical man, I am the stronger. There's no, there's no contest there. Like, yeah, Mark's got a good left hand, good, good upright boxer, but as for strength wise, there's no comparison. I am one of the strongest light. If not, you know what? I am the strongest lightweight in the country, without a doubt. Same with your chest, tell him. I'm saying it with my chest. Look, I've got, I've got a belt. I've got a belt. I say what I want now. You've got to listen to me. <laughs> we are listening. Look, when you come back here, first thing I heard you say was, you know what? He's a nice fella, is old Sean Cooper. He is. You know what? I know it's funny, but it does make a difference. You know when you all chat? Because all that, all that, all giving out, it's all bollocks. It's all bravado. It's all bullshit. Don't do nothing. It's nice when they're nice. It's nice to be nice, Dev. You know I mean? You're a nice guy. You know how it is, mate. I try. So, so what's next? I mean, you got this now. You got this bauble. Presumably, you you want some more belts, um, and presumably, you just want to keep the streak going forever. Yeah, obviously. But I feel like I think that's exposed a few areas that I need to learn on. I mean, like that's a brilliant fight that my team have got to write. Like got Francis, but Al and that they picked a good learning fight for me. I mean, I got caught with a silly few shots, and I mean, when you get to the top levels, can't be eating shots like that. I know like, I'm tough on that, but you don't want to be eating all them. I want to be pretty at the end of this, but. <laughs> You know what I mean? I'm straight back in the gym. I need to learn. Like I'm still maturing as a fighter. I'm not going to say I'm this young kid or whatever because I'm not. I mean, you've got people my age across the water who are world tight champions. So I've just got to mature properly as a pro. I've got a good team behind me. Do you know what I mean? And I'm going to do it properly. Look, you've got the whole world in your hands, mate. Everything's going really, really well for you. Anyone you want to thank before I let you go? Yeah, I want to thank Francis. Like He's been absolutely brilliant with me. Al and the boys, you know what I mean, their family. I've got to fake my old dear, I've always go mad. I mean, like, she's got my diet on point. You've got all these nutritionists with all these yeah, yeah. diplomas and that, but I'll tell you, a big shaz is food, mate. That's where it's at. I'm hearing that your mum's actually added Sean Cooper on oh, Facebook. Oh, you, you're you're loud, didn't you? No, wait, don't do it, Sharon, don't do it. <laughs> Congratulations, Sam. Cheers, Dev. Thanks a lot. Cheers, mate. Cheers, well done.